website, Iowa Beard Co. has got a brand new scent to the permanent lineup. It's called Homesick. And this is a little different type of scent than what Justin usually puts out. Maybe one or two things that are kind of Iowa-ish, if you will. But we're going to get into all the details in just a second. But welcome. First, my name's Brian. This is my Beards and Banjos YouTube channel, where we try to help you grow your best beard possible. Thank you so much for joining me. And I've been uh, friends with uh, Justin for I don't know how many years now, five years. The years are running together at this point. Tried a lot of different scents. Uh, Justin usually likes stuff. He's, he likes kind of sweeter scents, like a lot of amber, um, the type of scents, uh, a lot of kind of everyday type of scents that you don't get tired of smelling. Um, um, and there's some really good tropical scents that he's come out with as well, like Black Pearl and uh, Galleon and a lot of different stuff. Anyway, a lot of those are still available, including a collab that we have done. In fact, we've done two collabs. We did Sophisticated Cedar and we've done Hawthorne. So check those out. Hawthorne's a great one for this time of year, uh, in my opinion. But this one is called Homesick. And uh, let me go ahead and tell you the profile here. So it is Smoked Oud Suede Egyptian Amber Cedar Spiced, mu spiced musk, easy for me to say, and tobacco. So a little bit on the darker fare, and then the smokiness uh, is very interesting. The, uh, the smokiness to it really comes in about 30 minutes after you put it on, and it's the same type of smoke or smoked oud, uh, and I'm going to you know, invoke the name of another company. It reminded me a lot of 1912 there for about three hours in the middle. Not the top notes and not the way it finished, but right there in the middle, uh, it had that kind of smoking. It's just to paint a picture if you've ever used that particular scent. All right. Uh, off the top, and I told Justin that, he said, I've never tried that one. Uh, but anyway, if you tried uh, both of those scents, let me know if you uh, get a little bit of a similarity. A little bit cleaner and more manly on top. Um, so it does smell out of the bottle. You get like a nice kind of dark uh, type of cologne scent out of it. Uh, Egyptian amber, the Egyptian part when you put the, that type of amber has got a little bit more smoothness, a little bit more powdery, uh, which I think gives it a little bit cleaner scent than it would if it didn't have it in it. So you get that and probably the spice musk, maybe the suede, that's kind of what you get to start with. Um, and then once that first uh, pop starts to go away, the cedar comes through, uh, and then you get a little bit of that tobacco, and then the oud, and then the smoke part comes after about 30 minutes or so, uh, and then the smoky smokiness part to that uh, does last several hours, three or four hours, something like that, and then when that goes away, the smokiness, it kind of reverts back, and you get the, I would say, suede and uh, an oud um, cedar and the tobacco would be one kind of what goes on the longest, but it definitely changes throughout the day. So um, if you haven't tried Iowa stuff or haven't tried them in a long time, pretty complex sense in that it's usually not going to be one thing you smell all day. It's going to really change. And this one changes a lot. Uh, and, and I like all the ways it smells and I didn't get tired of smelling it. Uh, well, like a lot of smoky scent, sometimes I kind of get tired of the smokiness. This one, it lasted a uh, several hours, the smokiness, and then it kind of moved on to something else. A really, really complex, uh, well-balanced scent. Uh, I really enjoy that one. Uh, to me, it's a colder weather type of scent, and this is one I'm going to reach for in October when the first cold uh, snap of the season hits, football weather, all that kind of stuff. I think I'm going to, uh, uh, if I can remember, because I've tried so many scents, I think I'm going to reach for home uh, homesick at that particular time for homecoming, right? And that kind of stuff that's around that time of year. Anyway, you can get, um, all, you can always use the code BANJO15, um, so that'll get you 15% off. Plus, there's always free U.S. shipping on every order, so uh, I know that's going to save you a lot of money. Oil is $18 for a one ounce, uh, a two ounce butter for 20, that's a poured butter, balm for 18, uh, and then you can get a combo, oil balm for 33, oil butter for 35. And I highly recommend this scent, uh, very good and complex and manly, if you will. Uh, and then please come back and let me know if you've tried that particular scent uh, called Homesick and how you like it. And as always, I appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you soon.